What's up everyone, Takedown here, welcome back to another video. Today we have another puzzle for you, and that is the IQ Fits from Puzzle Master. This is the L Challenge, and I'm pretty interested in this. This is, this is not like some of the other puzzles I have done. The cast puzzles and everything else I've done takes a lot longer of time. This here is just a fun game for little ones, but I want to choose it and share it with you guys because it is very interesting. So we're going to open it up here so you guys can take a closer look and see what it's all about. So in behind this, is the instructions and it's pretty straightforward honestly. The Magic L puzzle you have to find there is six different ways to form a square using these pieces, four pieces per shape. So you'll take four of these pieces to form a perfect square. And then you have different shapes to make with those pieces. So it's going to be very interesting. I'm not going to be using a timer for this video because it's pretty much going to be straightforward. If I have to speed up the time, it's not something that I need to keep track of how long it actually takes me. So there is four red pieces, four yellow pieces, four blue, and four green. I'm just going to separate them here quickly. And we're going to start off with the squares. Now I'm not going to build all of the different ones because this puzzle includes 24 puzzles, which is really cool because that's how many options with the different shapes you have. Here's all of the different shapes, um, different options and different ways that you can make all of the shapes. So we're just going to start with the first one here with the blue. That is a square. So that's the first one. So I'm assuming each of these pieces you can do just that with. I'm assuming. I'm already getting it wrong. Don't assume things. All right, there is the second one, two yellows and two greens. Let's see if I can make a third one here with just the red. And you can, so that actually isn't too bad. That won't take your little ones too long to complete. So now, Let's try some of the more, I don't know, in a way, advanced ones. We're just going to see what we can make here. I'm going to take two blue. Two blue and two blue. How did I do that just now? Like that. Okay, there's that one. Oops, parallelogram wasn't even showing the camera there. And then that's the other one, almost like an arrow where it's a point on this side. Let's see how to do it with these ones here. Looks like a hexagon. So there's all three shapes. Two. 
three and the square. So this one here, it's not necessarily a challenge puzzle by any means. And for anybody that's looking on Puzzle Master for a real challenge to them, I wouldn't recommend this one. This one here, in my opinion, would be more suited for children, uh, beginners maybe, uh, but definitely not somebody that's looking on Puzzle Master for an actual challenge. Kind of like how the U and U puzzle was which is an extremely challenging puzzle, and it took me quite a while to be able to do it. So this one here is more of for fun, and more, in my opinion, like I said, for children. I think that's why it's bright colors, and uh, it's very easy. It's not a hard puzzle. It's just literally a matter of finding. There's six ways to form a shape with using these puzzles, using these pieces. I already found three with the blue, red, and yellow, or green and yellow, and the red, so... There's obviously more ways along with the other shapes. So a simple puzzle, not anything too difficult. I definitely recommend if you have children or, you know, your nieces or nephews or anybody, this would be great for maybe family gatherings. If you're bringing some of the challenging puzzle for the adults, getting this and bringing this for the children would definitely be cool. And I think they'd absolutely love it because some of the challenging puzzles, kids would be really frustrated, but it would keep them busy for hours. So I will leave this link down below if you're interesting it uh, to order it for a gift for a young one or something like that. So like I said, it's not really challenging, so it's not for necessarily an adults, but it is still a pretty unique and I'm going to still say it's a fun puzzle, but it'd be fun with to do with little ones, basically not on your own by any means. So I will leave this puzzle linked down below along with Puzzle Master's homepage so you guys can check out some of their other puzzles as well. And I am an affiliate, so that will not only help me out, but also the channel. So if there's anything you guys see, even with the sales coming up, I think they're going to be doing sales for Christmas. Definitely recommend checking out Puzzle Master. Like I said, I'll leave them linked down below. But I'm going to leave this video here. Hope you guys enjoyed. Please take care. Peace.